el caminito para enseñárselos a mí Ladies and gentlemen, we have arrived to the Mayan community of Nuevo Durango. As you can see, this pup is my guide. We're going to explore the village. She's exploring the luggage. So awesome. Again, this is going to be a good opportunity for us to interact with people of different cultures, as well as to learn about the scientific facts of this jungle, this forest. So, ladies and gentlemen, take notes. There's another dog. But that's okay, the first one has got my heart. Wow, that dog has a really long tail. That's a ridiculously long tail. Does it say? There's a cavern. Huerto organico, so there's organic fields. Pozo de las Golondrinas is a well. Actually, this is the cenote that Angel was talking about. Six o'clock, the swallows will come into or out of the well. Señor, este es el reporte del noticiero de Nuevo Durango. ¿Cómo se llama usted? Julio. Julio, mucho gusto, Julio. ¿Y cuántos años tiene? Seis. ¡Seis años! ¡Wow! Y a ver, señor Julio, ¿qué le gustó hacer a usted para divertirse? Jugar. Jugar. ¿A qué tipos de juegos juega? En la casita. ¿En la casita? ¡Wow! ¿Y usted es el arquitecto de la casita? ¡Ay, qué bueno, qué bueno! ¿Y quiénes más viven con usted en esa casita? Jimena, Zuleni, mis amigos. ¿Tus amigos? ¿Y se encuentra Zulemi? ¿Dónde está? Aquí. ¡Allí! Hola, señorita Zulemi. ¿Cómo, sigue? Uh, ¿Cómo está usted? Bien. ¡Qué bueno, qué bueno! ¿Y cuántos años tiene usted? Once. Once, ¿y usted qué le gusta jugar? Eh, ¿qué dijo mi También a la casita. ¿Y usted fue diseñadora de la casita? Sí. Sí, también, entre los dos la construyeron. Adiós. Adiós. ¿La voy a ver a usted el domingo también? Sí. Sí. Ok, la veo el domingo. Bye, Frank. ¿Mañana se va? No, hasta el domingo. ¿Qué día soy? ¿Jueves? Sí. Sí, son dos días. Nos vamos a quedar aquí dos otros días y luego el domingo nos vamos a ir. Look, young ones. The same guys that I left for you guys in the classroom are the ones that we're using here for our journey to the jungle. Just wanted to show you. You see what? Oreo. Yeah. Alright, young ones, we're on our first hike. Started off on a 
pretty well paved road. And now we're heading into the jungle. Did I put on the bottom part of my pants? No. But we were promised we didn't need to. <laughs> these drip tips, a lot of these drop because of the amount of water that comes in, they need to shed water. So very waxy cuticles, and often these spouts. Okay, the other reason why I stopped this tree, I pulled one leaf off, and can you notice something oozing out of it? White oh. stuff? No food. Okay, that tells me this is the ficus genus. Uh, there are 8,000 ficus species that have been identified. Okay. Uh, this one I call Fike One. Where you hopefully use the word if. <laughs> I'll try not to get in. Uh -huh. Part of me wants to pass. But time features, we do not. So we're going to look at that spider, even if I am afraid of spiders. Anybody else want to move up? Yeah. To see it? Okay. Yes. Please move back so we get everybody to see it. Everybody wants to see it. Young ones, let this be a lesson. Give it a chance even if you're scared. <laughs> We like breezes. Yeah. No, yeah. As in any good marriage, I guess. Who else back here wants to move forward? Okay, so we got one. Uh, I will use you as my end then. Okay. <clears throat> There's a spider up here if you'd like to take a picture. No, nope, I'm not going to take a picture. Yeah, we're going to turn this off to take a picture instead. This is a disused termite nest here. I'm holding part of the nest in my hand. This part is called carton, C-A-R-T-O-N, makes good fertilizer, but it looks like somebody took a machete to this termite nest. So you can take a look at that as you go by. Make some mental observations. Then I'm going to say turn left, 90 degrees. You've got a minute again. Then turn left. You're going to have a minute again. And finally, your last turn, your fourth turn. Okay? Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. All right, so I'll time us. Can we'll write things down? You can if you'd like. Okay. All right, young scholars, check this. Army ants mm -hmm. taking over their home. They're trying to take all the little eggs out. You can actually hear. Did you hear them? Yes, if you come down far enough, you can hear the... Don't kneel on the ground. No. What are they... What do you hear? The click. Young ones! The swallows are returning to their home in the cenote.
Am I in anyone's way? Because it was walking. You, no. I can't tell, yeah, this is. No, because they weren't there earlier. They, they might have been, and they didn't. Maybe, maybe they're emerging they now. Them. Yeah, maybe this is for some reason. Like, so, yeah, that one's kind of different when the one that's going the other way. Appropriate response. Oh, beautiful. Young students, this is what your science teachers do. Watch out. Pearl snake, yeah, this so these are venomous, snake. yeah. Oh, it looks kind of... Go up, come, snake! I had a stick in there. Right on yellow killer fellow, right on black venom leg. Does that still apply here? Perfect. Grab it from this end, because this will bias the data. Oh, no. 84% uh, humidity, 96 points... Or, no, sorry. Wow. 29.6 degrees Celsius. Yes, okay, and if you want Fahrenheit, all you have to do is toggle the button. Right here? Yeah, do you see it? Yeah, so we've got 85.3, 85.5. That might be my finger. I'm surprised it's not hotter. Okay. Ooh, there's more growths. There's little growths. Yeah, that's it. All over it. Lots of fungus. Yeah. They're part of the, uh, the FBI, you know? <laughs> fungus, bacteria, fungus invertebrates. <laughs> All right, young ones. So we just we just gathered data on the trees. There's a bird over there or something. And now we're going back to base camp. Oh, that was a beautiful orange butterfly. And there it is, ladies and gentlemen, the elusive butterfly with the intrepid photographer. Keeps opening his wings for you. Right, right over there. See it? It's oh, right. Right. It's just for... Students, it's forget about Pokemon Go. You gotta go get yourselves outdoors. See the big branch. See the big dead thing over there. Come toward here. Only macro. And then behind it. Hold on, folks. What happened? I just saw the poisonous tree. Oh no! Which one? Did we touch it? Right here. Oh, it's a baby. Which one? Oh, no. this tiny skinny one? Yeah, see this dark green? Here's the distinction. Usually in the adult form, it's a white bark with rectangular scales. The leaf has this wavy edge to it. See that, yep. see that wavy edge? So this is the J. Chen or Met Metopian brownie. Oh, there it goes. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Coming this way? I wanted to get a closer look at the sure. Chen. We will see some larger ones. Too. All right, young ones. See the wavy leaf. The wavy leaf. leaf. Chen. Is it as irritating if you touch it when it's young, or more so? More so. And it's so oh, volatile that even coming within proximity, some people break out in a rash. Oh, wow. And this is the last we heard of our photographers. I'm just kidding. Freaking through the jungle. Learning is what we do. Spider web in there, guys. As you can see, though, folks, this is kind of what we tell you guys when we do that part about uh, environmentalism, that unit. You can see that trash kind of makes its way everywhere. 
if we don't dispose of it properly or if we're not disposing of it carefully. So, the thing is, big countries like ours are the ones that start off with these particular products and then they get shipped off to uh, countries that are not as... Oh, that's a blue morphos butterfly. As I'm saying, they get shipped off to countries that are smaller than us and that don't really have the abilities that we do to take initiative and, and recycle things. Right? So it's kind of like we're taking our garbage and sending it off to other places that can't handle it or that can't afford to not have it. And since it's now taken over, like paper wrapping and everything else, my mom used to tell me stories. When she was a kid, there were no plastic bags. Everybody had a little moralito. Okay? And when you went to the store and people needed to wrap things up, they didn't wrap it up in plastic, they wrapped it up in paper. And so when you went around town and the like, you didn't find all sorts of trash. So we need to make sure that we're setting the example for other places. Diana, you're gonna wanna photograph this. Okay, I am on my way. This and this is the acacia and the ants oh. are on it. Yes, indeed. So, young ones, this is the ant acacia. Uh, it has a symbiotic relationship with Aztec ant is what they're called. These are fearsome little warrior dudes where if an herbivorous animal or a plant eater is coming by to try to eat this particular plant, the ants will attack. In addition to that, you can see that there are some gnarly looking spines on this thing. You might be wondering why the ants like to come to this particular plant or why they help it out. Well, underneath the leaves, somewhere down here, there are little cups called nectaries, okay, that are filled with a sugary sweet liquid for these ants to feast on. And so since the ants don't have to go looking out for food, they protect their plant food source. It's pretty awesome. Change my mind. That's okay. Philip, what's the planet? What's the planet? Planet. I don't know. Alright, younglings. Teachers are going on a night hike. We're gonna go see if we can find the eye shine of all the little forest critters that live here. The majority of them, or at least the mammals. What happens is that they have this reflective. Uh, I wouldn't describe it as a film, but they have a reflective part behind their eyes called the tapetum lucidum. And that is what reflects the light from our flashlights. You may have noticed mine is red. It's to disturb them a little bit less. <laughs> so we'll see. We were told that we might see jaguars tonight. Fingers crossed that we see them and that they don't eat us. Or that the dogs don't eat us. Alright, we'll see what we find. Yeah. Oh no. This is where we put our traps with the yeah, dog food. There. The dog's going to find them. Okay, uh, if you've never done the spider thing, this is a good place to do it. So you see what you're looking at. Okay, uh, if your flashlight is parallel to your eyes, like right now you might be thinking, okay, how does this old guy see a spider right over here? Oh wow. Okay. Oh, yeah. They are everywhere. Mm -hmm. Like little green diamonds. Oh, wow. Those, oh, are, all, wow. those are all wolf spiders. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, they look, look ahead. Oh, that's cool. There's a dog. Mm. Yeah, well. Oh, my God. There they okay. are. Okay. Oh. Uh, and everybody see that? Hell to my Yeah, I think if we had just one light on, we'd see more of them. Oh, yeah. Oh my goodness, I just, oh. Okay. By the way, we'll do a little oh, yeah. oh my This is that saber tree. Right here is the saber tree. Not you guys. Right here. What does that mean? Junglings, I don't know if you can see that, but. He has a spider on the trail over here that you can see really well. There are quite a few spiders around. It's a little, excuse me. Are they just spiders? I feel like I'm looking at. Yeah, they should be wolf spiders. 
it's just both spiders. Mm -hmm. oh. Wait, does that one have babies on his back? Right? Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, look at how he's glistening too. Yeah. Yes. I'm surprised how... Dan, those are the babies? No. No? No, like on its back. What's it? Why is it textured like that on its back? Yeah, those are little things growing on it. Yeah, head. okay, this is bomb with the babies on her back. Oh, do, oh does she have her God. babies? Yes. Cool, yeah, 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 look at that. That's this awesome. one, she's carrying her little babies. That's awesome. That was like yeah. her eyes, yeah. That's her eyes that are glistening. That's cool. That's right. Your teacher. I'm pretty sure those are tadpoles. Was it tadpole? Yes, maybe. The little ones? Yeah, they are. Yeah. Or are they or are they mosquitoes? No, they look like tadpoles. Tadpoles. Oh. The micro, the micro. Oh, that's cool. Be careful. You get it right behind the tail. He said it doesn't catch you if you get it behind the tail. You can't do anything. Because it's the tail that does, no? Right. You just holding on to their life. Students do not do this at home. There's a here, guys. It's a scorpion. scorpion. Yeah, to get it, it's, you know, they can't, they can't, they don't have strong enough muscles in their tail to reach up. Ben. Ben, Nala. Come on. Nala. In his hands. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Scorpion. You know what kind of this is, Centroides. Centroides, yeah. Okay, see how it fluoresces right Yeah, look at that. Wow. Okay, now it's worth taking a picture. Oh, yeah, wow. That's awesome. Wow. I'm not taking a picture, you guys, because yeah, all of this will be posted later on. And it might eat her. <laughs> Uh, little piece, release a little bit of cyanide. Oh, almonds, like almond yeah. smell. Mm -hmm. Depends on the. What is it? Do they bite? What does cyanide no. smell like? It's almondy. And it's this kind of like sweet almond smell. I don't want to like disturb it, provoke it too much. Some of them like they just are much more defensive and they'll roll up right away. And you can smell <laughs> it. He's like, instead of them going to the making their road, you know? Yeah. 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 Oh, wow. Olympian mm. Oh, look at those huge ones. Yeah, those are the guards. Those are those the guards. Like, sentries that are kind of like yeah. making sure everything's going right. right. Blocking it off. Yeah. I'm going to kill Which the dog. The there's the really big ones on the outer. <laughs> right here, yeah, there's like one right there. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, careful, Pharaoh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Yeah, she got bitten. Some more with the little, yeah. with the feet. Oh, is that? Chachalacas. Chachalacas. Sí, chachalacas. Uh -huh. oh, chachalacas. I think they're like night jars. What is chachalacas? Are they like the bird. The bird. I know. Gotta think of a name for that dog. Her name is Nala. Nala. I'm sure the dog has a name. Alright, young ladies. Here's some leaf cutter ant mounds that you can actually see in the daytime instead of at night. But we are currently on our way to a cave, cavern. 
Which apparently is also a guti. Huh? Oh, no, it's okay. <laughs> Say hello, students. Hello, students. <laughs> You're such a cool teacher. <laughs> yeah, I didn't tell her to say that. <laughs> All right, younglings. We have arrived. No. 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 See? There is our cavern. <laughs> yeah, there's no. Okay. <laughs> ¿Cómo se llama? <laughs> Caverna de Pescuintle. Este es nombre Maya. Este es nombre Maya. Actun Jalep. Y el nombre de español es Caverna de Pescuintle. De Pescuintle. El jale es el tepesquintle. Sí, jale sí. es tepesquintle. Okay. So, entonces es árbol a uh, chacaj. Oh, no, like yeah. ¿Y yeah. dónde está el chichen? Chichen. We were out. Oh, is this where good reign supreme? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We'll see. Hi, I'm going to go put my helmet on. Looks like we're outfitted and ready. Outfitted, ready. We're going to be going down there in a line. We're going to get to see some. What did he say? Pseudo scorpions? Yeah. Uh, whip. whip scorpions. So be prepared. <laughs> um, if I'm not dead when we get back, um, I'm going to come to the garden with you, if you're okay. still going. Yes. Because yes. I would love to see it, but I might need you to... Oh no, he speaks English really well, right? Uh, which one? Enrique. Enrique? Yeah. Yeah, the, yeah, yeah. the one, the yeah, yeah. fellow that we're going to the... Yeah. Because I have some... I, want, I will probably ask a lot of questions. <laughs> Let's... Se van apoyando con la All right, younglings. <laughs> so who's going next? You? I guess. Watch me fall. Because I'm trying to... Uh, sí. <laughs> There's air conditioning down here, guys. Sí. Wow. Sí. Bueno. So generally speaking, kiddos, you don't want to touch. Mande. There's a small bat hanging down there, guys. If you follow the light, pero se oye. Es posible de tomar fotos. Una vez estamos, una vez estamos relajando. 
prendo un grupo que dentro. Oye, sí, el compañero. Voy a tomar unas fotos. Sí, le dice. Vamos este. A la salida vemos cuánto se tomó y, y se le okay. cobra, le dicen. Y no tomó fotos. Ah, era un relado. Un sapito, mira. ¿Dónde? Mira. En la silla de la luz. Sí, pero eso es que, eso es una. Una mariposa. Una mariposa y un sapo. Un There's a little toad. Un sapito. So it's a little toad and a little moth. Inside this um, formation, folks, there's a little toad that's it's, he just jumped onto this other side. He's got a little he's got his little dug out. It's actually pretty cute. Oh that moth. It's actually that's a that's some sort of tree frog. Uh-huh. Okay, he says that we teachers should stop wondering that he's gonna he's gonna take us places. <laughs> he's gonna lose one of He says it might we might get lost like somebody in a movie. He can't remember. But also folks I, I, I don't mean to be the forest ranger here, but when I worked for the Forest Service, uh, when you go into the caverns, they do say not to touch any of the structures just because the oils in your fingers are going to ruin them. Mm -hmm. Stragglers? <coughs> don't want to get lost in this cave. Yeah. They'll, they'll learn. The other guide is with them, though, right? Oh, yes. Yeah, okay. Unless you're really short and then you kind of almost have Unless you're the one big. <laughs> <laughs> that's amazing. Oh, I'm really short, but not that one. I have Oh, I can. Oh, whoa. Whoa. What is that? Oh, spider web? No. No, what is that? Is that silkworm stuff? I have no idea. Santiago. Una pregunta. Where are Esos filamentos. Estos. Uh-huh. Este es la humedad que lo. Que lo hace así. ¿Quién se cayó? ¿Quién se cayó? That's why we were hummets. He said it was because of the humidity, but I'm, I'm pretty sure they've got to be something else. I don't think he knows. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we did. Did Diana know what it was? No. Nope. Santiago didn't know what it was either. I keep thinking that these are like bones. Oh, God. <laughs> all the people that came in here before. Oh, bones? Yes, I thought it said bones too. <laughs> okay. Okay. Mr. Philip, you have to duck down a lot. Yes, he already found out. Okay. Oh, that was him. <laughs> oh. Like what happens in your house? <laughs> like super low. Oh my. Según los expertos que nos visitaron de de esa de esa clase de naturaleza, este comentaban que La formación de una estalactita, un, un centímetro, que es este... Yeah, there's a bigger rock. Watch your feet right here. Right there. Right there. Un centímetro. Un centímetro tarda cuánto para formarse? Diez años. Diez años. Sí. So, Santiago was saying that according to the experts that came to visit their cave, one centimeter of stalactite uh, takes about uh, ten years to wow. form. Si, sí, pase, pase usted si quiere. Oh no, he, want, he wants me to take a photo. I'm okay not taking a photo. <laughs> Are you okay? Don't panic because there's people behind you. No, I'm not panicking. Okay. Alright, so are you gonna go or not? Okay. Then let's go. Let's go. So wait, there's a scorpion? Scorpions are not scorpions. Use the back of your hand if you want. That's what I'm gonna do. They look creepy, but they can't hurt you. Come this way. What did I say? Yeah. 
<laughs> He's, he ran away too. You got it? You need a hand? You're gonna go? Oh, we're not even exiting, we're just going into another section. Whip scorpion. Is that the whip scorpion? Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna try to not use my hands. I'm using the back of my hands. Oh my goodness, that's amazing. It's totally harmless, right? Yeah. Totally harmless. As long as you wash it off within 20 minutes. Cool. Back of the hands. Back of the hands. Thank you for that. Of course, I was kind of giving myself a little pep talk. Give me. <laughs> You're more than welcome. <laughs> Folks, we survived. No one was lost. Thanks to all the other teachers and our guides. And the dog. They heat up, they heat up mm. and then they heat up the roots of the yeah. So what they did is they built the walls like this and then they said, oh, okay. Put like, like compost and butter, you know, leaves and roots and everything. And then tierra, or soil on top of that. And then the plant. Cada año, uh -huh. lo vamos a abrir a la mitad. Uh -huh. Y vamos a poner la tierra en el medio. Lo vamos a abrir a la mitad. So every year they open up the middle, they put more like cooking mm -hmm. you know, like mm -hmm. old trunks. Desinfectamos. ¿Cómo es eso? Con ceniza. Ceniza. Oh, with uh, ashes. So then sí. they, uh, they disinfect it with ashes. Exactly. Wow. Desinfectamos y volvemos a cubrir. Y está listo para cultivar. Es orgánico, porque nosotros no tenemos dinero para comprar fertilizantes y no queremos. Y no queremos, aparte que no queremos. No nos gusta. Siempre mejor. No nos gusta. Dios está con ustedes. Vean la lluvia. Se siente riquísima la lluvia. Oh man. It's so refreshing. Y luego le echamos la tierra que sobra. El viento corre de norte a sur aquí en la península de Yucatán. ¿Qué vamos a hacer? De norte a sur. Para que el aire no los tire. ¿Está bien? Está bien. Perfecto. Son 25 centímetros piedras norte a sur. Sí. Entonces, John, conmigo, vamos a ir haciendo los hoyos. Las chicas van a ir plantando. Ok. So he and John are going to make holes and we're going to plant. Okay. 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 Ok
All right, ladies. You want, put you, you want me to put your water bottle back here? I know. Oh, popcorn. There's so many plants everywhere. I was looking up for this it's one. Okay, it's okay. 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 Eh, los otros machetes, ¿dónde quiere que los dejemos? Ponla mi mochila. Okay. Ahí, pero en la dirección yo. Yes! It has a nice little like notch. Okay, if it fits between these two rocks. Oh, wait, it's yeah. north to south, is that correct? No, yeah. it wants to. Okay, great. Yeah. And then a key. Uh huh. North. Is that, are those ones okay? Yes. Yeah, good, there you go, perfect. I just needed okay. to make sure that I put enough soil in there so that it's straight. Sí, gracias. Creo que encontré el pica pica. Sí. También la chaya te hace lo mismo. Sí, que pica. Ah, mira, que Tienes que ponerle un poquito de Guys, so there's a plant that I think is like a nettle. Yes, it really, really hurts. Yeah, I touched it too. I think I also. I do. have No, no, no problem. Kiddos, I'm turning this off because this is hindering my work. Find his backpack, the machetes, and all the water So. Oh, and I think I touched the pick-up with my legs. I can.